All right, if you've wondered how much about half a million views gets you, how much money that is, how much small YouTubers make, I'm here to answer some of those questions. I'm my Skyler, let's get started. All right, I'm gonna begin under analytics, just looking through some of my, my earnings, basically is what I'm gonna start with, because that's what most people probably care about. So I'm gonna get right to that. So uh, let's just look at the whole year. I just started my monetization about four months ago. So that's about the time frame we're looking at here. So total revenue of $190, which I think is great. Some people are like, oh, that's nothing. It's more than zero. We also have the videos. So this video right here, the slider button answer is a terrible video. It's just bad, but it does excellent. $70, that's like almost half of my revenue right there. So let's just take a quick look at this video and look at a couple of my top earning videos. This one is at a total of almost half a million views now, total. Oh, hi kitty cat. Cat has decided to make an appearance. We can tell how bad it is just by a few things here. The view percentage drops really fast, like really fast and just keeps dropping. Uh, but it does get information across and it's a highly searched topic. So in that regard, it does do well as a video. So the revenue, so $50 in the last 90 days. Question is how many views is that? 29K, so 30K, we'll go with that. 30K views, $50 is what this video has made me, which I find awesome. This video has done really well. I love these impression numbers are huge. 140K people in the last 90 days have seen this video. Let's just quickly look at the whole year, 2 million impressions. Scrolling through YouTube, two million people have seen this, which I find crazy. I have a thousand subscribers, that's it. And two million people have seen this one video, albeit it is my biggest one, but yeah. Another thing, let's see, this one has affected, yeah, my subscribers, 671. That's half of my subscribers have come from this one video. This video has boosted me so much. So like, never hold back from making that one video. Any video could be the one to get you 671 subscribers. This video is just crazy with the stuff it's done for me. Let's move on to another video. I wanna, yeah, I wanna look at the second one. I, this is the other one I wanna look at. What happens when you steal an iPhone from an Apple store was just such a fun one to make. I love this video and it's made me $30 which is great. I probably put six hours of work into it, so about $5 an hour on this video. Super fun video, love making it. Uh, it's a good one to watch. People actually enjoy this one. You can see it's got much better retention, uh, a lot of likes, a lot like engage. In there's a tab for this, engagement. Yeah, engagement. Average view duration is a minute 40, which is above what my other ones get. Really good there. I mean, it's something to notice here, is you can see it highlights it, the intro. People are skipping over the intro, getting into the actual video, which there's a point to be made there. There's an intro in like all my videos where I just say stuff to get into the topic, which some people may not just care about. They wanna skip right into the topic. And pretty much that's what that dip reflects perfectly right there. So yeah, these are the videos I wanted to look at. There's my total revenue. So again, past 90 days, I have made $150. Awesome. And that's from 60K views. So I like those numbers. Those are pretty good numbers. Yeah, that's my monetization in 2020. Now let's look at the whole year and let's look at some of the, the analytics. Subscribers, this one is crazy. You can see almost a thousand subscribers in the past year. The beginning of the year was huge for me. Uh, actually, it's not as huge as I thought it was. I remember in the beginning of the year thinking it was just crazy, I was getting so many. But I mean, you can see there was a spike, but then in April there was also a spike, and in August there's also a spike, the same height. And then other than that, it's just pretty normal. So I guess I kind of went up, spiked, came back down, and that's what I normally am at now. So I guess, I, I mean, I, I definitely improved from last year. The break from last year's content going into this year's, I took that December off and most of that January as well. Started making a bunch of new, better content and it was just such a big leap and it just, it made such a big difference. It improved a lot and you can see that reflected in the subscribers. I, I just hit 200. 
and now I'm just about to hit 1200. That, that's the difference a year can make. It's crazy. And $200. Oh, this is going to be a fun one. Let's look at the impressions. 2.6 million. That, that's a million. That's a big number right there. So a thousand subscribers. This is just from making video. It's probably about a video every week is probably what it averages out to. And it gets all these impressions. It's, it's a lot. And then uh, about a half a million views. Okay, let's look at the audience statistics. These are some fun ones. What do we got? Oh, okay. This is a new thing YouTube added. It's when your viewers are on YouTube. So you can see most of my, I'm Eastern time. So these times are gonna be that. Um, most of them are during the day. You can see the darker color. So right around noon, 10 to like one is the hot spot. So, I mean, there's so many different ways to interpret this. It could be Americans in the middle of the day watching, could be Europeans watching in the afternoon, could be Indians watching late at night. Like, I, I don't even know, this doesn't even mean much but it's just interesting to see. Some people will look at this and think, oh, I should publish my videos then, but notice disclaimer at the bottom, YouTube, YouTube says it doesn't affect it, but you could take that into account. Here's another one, which is actually, whoa, which I don't think I've looked at this one. Subscribers who've turned on notifications for my channel is 253, 20% of people have hit the bell. Something I never asked for, but People have done it. Uh, oh, whoa, okay, so here's my watch time from subscribers. Yeah, this one, most of my viewers are not subscribed. Like, I could do the thing where I say, I could, I could see, I could pop this at the front of my video and be like, 99% of you are not subscribed, but I don't, I don't do that, I don't do that. I get a lot of search and recommended is where a lot of the views come from. So next year, the goal is to make the videos a whole lot better so that people want to stick around even more. That's the goal. Uh, age and gender, we can see mostly male, uh, mostly split between 18, 44, 18 to 44 years old, wide range. Geography is an interesting one, except they got rid of the map. They used to have this map. I can't find it anymore. And it showed a whole map of all the people watching. It was super cool. Like you could see like almost all the countries there were people watching from. Not here anymore. But we can just look at the list, see some interesting countries here. Uh, US, India, UK, Russia, Canada are the top ones. Pretty big countries, makes sense. Uh, scroll down, we can see some more fun ones here. Uh, Egypt, Thailand, Kuwait, Bulgaria, Norway at the bottom, except there's more here. I, I could export it and see even more. I'm not going to, just gonna look at that. Um, and let's check out device. No, this isn't the right one. Actually, let's look at device type, then we're gonna get more specific with the devices. So most people are watching on a mobile phone. Makes sense, most people do. Then a tablet, computer, TV, and this is the one that is crazy. 4,000 people viewed me on a game console. Like, people are watching YouTube on a game console, and we can even see it more specifically which consoles they're watching on. So this is, this is great. Operating system, we could see Android actually tops iOS. So I got more people watching on Android than iOS, which is interesting because I'm an Apple channel who has specifically probably said things about Android. Windows, KaiOS, KaiOS. I don't even know what KaiOS is. Let's see, KaiOS. I have like how many viewers? 10,000 people watched me from this mobile operating system company based in Hong Kong. So this is probably an Asian, more Asian thing, because I've never heard of it. Uh, Nintendo Switch, two, YouTube, wait, YouTube is on. YouTube is on the eShop, all right. Uh, 2,000 from Nintendo Switch, 1,600 from PlayStation, 1,000 from Xbox, so. You can see here, PlayStation better than Xbox, obviously, because it's got more viewers in here. Uh, scroll down and we can see a random console at the very bottom. I don't, I don't know why it's here. 25, and even, okay, 25 views from Wii for some reason this year. 25 people watched on the Wii. I don't know why, don't know who is still. Okay, last thing I wanna check out here is sharing, sharing. So we can see a lot of shares. Like, it's kind of surprising that a thousand times my video was shared. 
I mean, the copies, probably a hundred of them were me bringing my video over to share it. But then WhatsApp, I don't use WhatsApp. Text message, Facebook Messenger, a whole bunch of people actually sharing my videos. Really kind of cool. Um, and that's just about it. That's just about what I want to look at here. So yeah, those are the analytics of a YouTube channel with 1,000 subscribers, about a half a million views, who just turned on monetization. I'm Ice Skyler. Thanks for watching. Bye. I just finished recording, but I forgot to tell the story about why the internet's so slow. For some reason, the internet just not working. The Wi-Fi, Ethernet, just couldn't get it to work. Yeah, that's a problem. So I took my phone, hot spotted it to the computer with my last little bit of data. I've got like point, I got like half a gigabyte left of data to use. And it's hot spotted to the computer. It's really slow. I even, I even wired it. I connected my phone to the computer. It's pretty slow. I was actually impressed by how much it worked, but yeah, just wanted to throw that in there.